Hey everyone, it's John from Ride Upstate, and Chad the Gig Economist made a video recently about showing off your vehicle that you do your gig work in, and so that's what I'm going to do right now. And before I forget, I want to mention uh, Joe Gig, uh, Mr. Flex, and UDM. I want to challenge you three to do the same. Chad's going to donate $1,000 to the American Heart Association. I think that's what he said, right? Uh, if you got, if everyone, if he gets, what, a, a hundred people doing, showing off their gig vehicles. So, let's go. All right, so this is my 2010 Prius. Why are the lights still on? They must not have turned themselves off yet. And uh, it's got about 212,000 miles on it. It's a little rough around the edges, I'll admit. Let's go get in the cockpit here. All right, so let's see. Let's check that mileage. Uh, the motor's coming on because the battery's low and it's hot outside. 212,701 miles, and we are still getting roughly 45 miles per gallon. Uh, this is where I keep my personal phone, and then I put my work phone up here. This is it's a wireless charger, but I, because I'm mostly doing rideshare now, I typically just plug it in that way because it charges faster and it doesn't get too hot. Um, got my dash cam that records inside and outside. Um, it's got this for sunglasses, but I don't wear sun, separate sunglasses. Uh, that little set of pegs over there is for my Uber and Lyft light. It lights up. I don't know if you can see that or not. Probably not. Uh, that goes in there in the dash. There's some personal safety equipment in there. Uh, this is a cup holder. Uh, there's another cup holder here. And then there's this cubby where I keep some wipes. I've got a charger in there, some masks, and some air freshener. Uh, especially if you look and look this is stuff right here osium that's what you want I use that all the time passenger gets in smelling like dope or whatever you know all right let's go around to the back here all right nothing too special about the back seats you know I mean it's typical back seat I got rubber mats back here that really helps. It's dirty. I'm sorry. You know, got the little fold down with the two cup holders. Really nothing fancy in the back. Let's check out the trunk. Now, I do have some junk in the trunk, so please excuse me. Uh, this is just a privacy cover. It comes right off. This is my uh, Uber bag that I use use my uber bag for deliveries every once in a while whenever I do a delivery uh, but the real secret to the Prius is this right here is this storage area this flips up and you can get so much stuff underneath here I've got uh, got my cleaning supplies over here got some bottled water I got some uh, disc golf discs because you never know when you get an opportunity to play disc golf I got some plastic bags and you know some basic cleaning supplies uh, there's a little cubby here that you can keep stuff in so it's really kind of a nice deal if I'm doing a roadie gig and uh, I need to put a bunch of stuff in here I can fold down the seats and I can get like stuff six feet long in here so yeah, uh, you know, it's rough around the edges, but like I said, it gets the job done. Um, I've been happy with it since I bought it. And uh, yeah, at 45 miles per gallon, you know, you can't really complain. I haven't had to do too much to it. I had to replace uh, the air conditioning compressor. I put new struts on the front and I got new springs. And, uh, and shocks coming pretty soon that I'm going to put on the rear. And that's really it. 
you know, besides brakes and tires, right? So there you go. So that's the Gigmobile. Um, it does everything from ride share to occasional food delivery. You guys know my deal with food delivery because there's no insurance. I don't really do it that much. And uh, occasionally I'll do uh, a roadie gig if the price is right. So that's it. I hope you do the same. Let's uh, let's get Chad to that uh, thousand dollars. All right. Bye. And no, this is not my house. And that Ford F-150 you saw in the background is also not my Ford F-150.